As customers continue to leverage CrowdStrike's growing solution set, there are always new opportunities for automation and process improvements. Today, we are going to look at the latest enhancements to the Falcon APIs that were made possible with the introduction of OAuth 2. These improvements illustrate CrowdStrike's continued commitment to evolve and meet our customers' growing needs. First, why is OAuth 2 important? This is the latest version of an industry standard framework to automate application access. For CrowdStrike specifically, this kind of functionality has always enabled customers to interact with the Falcon solution outside of the traditional UI. With OAuth 2, CrowdStrike has not only been able to expand the available APIs, but also improve end-user experience with rich functionality and ease of API management. OAuth 2 provides increased security, flexibility, and control for API access. Here we see a basic overview of the workflow for OAuth 2. OAuth 2 introduces an API authorization gateway and the concept of access tokens. With this model, the client ID and secret no longer have to be provided for each API call. After the initial authorization, the issued token can be used for multiple calls until the configured expiration time, at which point the client credentials are provided again for a new token. Now that we have seen how OAuth 2 works, what are the advantages for CrowdStrike customers? First, this development provides a method for self-service functionality. Customers can now create, modify, or delete API clients directly in the Falcon UI. They no longer have to contact and work with CrowdStrike support to provision new API access. At the same time, the self-service interface also gives customers a way to reset secrets as needed. Second, this new methodology means that customers can manage multiple client IDs on a per SID basis. For each client ID that is created, customers can specify exactly what API scopes should be available. Changes to that scope can be made seamlessly in the UI and realized immediately without requiring a change on the client side. Next, it is important that customers are able to maintain tight controls over API permissions. In addition to defining the API scope, there is the ability to control read and write access separately for each of the APIs. The Falcon UI also provides audit logs including a timestamp and username associated with any changes to the API clients. And finally, OAuth 2 gives CrowdStrike the ability to quickly add new APIs in the coming months. As we will see today, the Containment API is just one example of the new functionality that will be introduced. Let's take a look at the new UI and how these advantages will be realized by customers. First, we see the new API client management interface available to Falcon administrators. It can be found under Support, API, Clients, and Keys. Here we see all of the existing clients along with a date of creation and modification. At the top, there is a menu to add new API clients. For this example, we are going to generate a new client that will only need access to the Detection API in read-only mode. We are first prompted to assign a name and description. Below that, we can specify the API scope for this new client. This is where we define what API capabilities are required. In this example, we will check the box for read access to detection. Once we choose to save, we are presented with the new client ID and the associated secret. We will copy that secret for later use. Back on the management page, we see our new Read Detect client. For each existing client, we have three menu options. We can edit the existing permissions. This gives you self-service access to expand or reduce the number of APIs a client can access, as well as their ability to read or write within each individual API. You also have the option to reset the security secret for each client, and to delete clients that are no longer needed. Also in the top menu, there is an option to view the logging. All of those changes we just reviewed would be reflected here. Today, customers often face challenges with API development. 
They frequently use multiple tools like Terminal or Postman for testing, and documentation is often lacking. To address this, CrowdStrike is now leveraging the Swagger interface. This industry standard will provide customers with one place to see and learn about the available APIs. In addition to examples, customers will have immediate access in the UI to API descriptions, parameters, and response codes. Customers will also be able to generate and test code through Swagger. Here we see a sample of the Swagger interface. This conveys all of the calls available so that users can quickly identify the best options to meet their needs. Given our use case, we will look at the API options for detects and drill down on a specific result. If we expand gets detect IDs that match the provided filter criteria, we are presented with the required parameters for that query as well as their descriptions. Below that are the expected responses as well as sample code. For each call, you also see a Try It Now option. This gives you editable fields for each parameter so that you can customize and test calls specifically for your environment. With Swagger, you have all of the tools and documentations you need on the same page. By leveraging OAuth 2 and Swagger, CrowdStrike has been able to expand the availability and usability of the API platform. OAuth 2 enables customers and partners to manage a complete life cycle of API clients with a customized scope and function. The enhanced APIs and improved user experience provide automated access to the Falcon platform and the wealth of events and information available to help customers understand the status of their environment while striving to continually improve their security posture through automation and analysis. Thank <laughs> you.